one race. Two brothers. Chad Leather started Cupid's Undie Run to help find a cure for neurofibromatosis, or NF, a rare disorder that affects his brother Drew's nerve tissues. You can't see them, but the disease causes yeah. Drew to have tumors throughout his body. He had a tumor of grapefruit size in his chest that caused him to stop playing football. He was this athletic kid. He was doing everything. And, I mean, he was just brought to his knees from this issue. So Chad and his friends put their bodies to work in ways Drew couldn't. They wanted to raise money for NF research. We have such a close tie to it because of Drew's story, because of that personal connection that we really wanted to make a difference. And so we didn't want to do one of those 5Ks or those walkathons. We wanted to have that impact. Let's do it Valentine's Day. Let's have Cupid in the name, and let's do it in our underwear around the US Capitol. The four started Cupid's Undie Run in DC. Hey, check this out. Not bad, huh? And runners gather at a local bar before braving the winter air. They show their support with skin, but many say being chilly is a small price to pay to help kids with NF. They have to overcome a lot of adversity, and when I'm running outside in my underwear and freezing, you know, I kind of dedicate that to them. So not only is it fun, but I feel like I'm overcoming something and sort of part of that walk with them. When the race started in 2010, they were only expecting about 30 people and got more than 600. This year, there are about 1,000 people running in their underwear, and D.C. is one of 18 cities holding the race. This is my greatest accomplishment, and this is our greatest accomplishment. Cupid's Undie Run has raised more than a million dollars worldwide, and the race paid Drew's way through a clinical trial. Now, Chad works full-time for the Children's Tumor Foundation, constantly raising money for a cure. It is because of this team that we are here today, and it's because of this team that we're going to find cures, frankly. You know, it's, it's, it's a miracle. It's a matter of time. It is a matter of time. Just like it was only a matter of time before Drew was off bed rest, and Chad could push him across the finish line of the Atlanta Cupid's Undie Run. Stacy Welsh reporting.